already for the rest of us, I mean, for most people, really, finding clothes sometimes in the morning can just be such a nightmare. Have you ever <laughs> left your house and then you come back in the evening and you think, I don't know, you start wondering what was happening in your house because in the morning you were just throwing things all over the place trying to find an outfit. Or even when you're out shopping, sometimes it can be frustrating. Um, you can imagine how that can be, though, for a woman who maybe now is a beautiful plus size woman sometimes that can be even more challenging you have to keep in mind the fabrics the fit the patterns the colors the shaping all of those things then come into play well you know what we want to help out all of our gorgeous plus size queens today and with me here in the studio is trufosa wayodi who's a, a plus size stylist karibu sana to the show thank you joyce wow it's yes. great to have you here and mm -hmm. i could see you nodding as i was talking about <laughs> <laughs> you know the morning wardrobe you know issues yes you have a closet full of clothes and you're like i can't find anything to wear and exactly. we leave our house is a mess and i mm -hmm. imagine it's the same too with yes. plus size women if not more it is even worse mm -hmm. yes uh so for plus size mostly i think uh since i deal mostly with the uh, the selling part. Mm -hmm. I am a plus size entrepreneur. Mm -hmm. So I know the challenges that comes with uh, being plus size yeah. and getting the right fit for your outfit and also one that stands out. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So I believe that also as a plus size lady, you are supposed to not just wear stretching fabric, mm -hmm. but one that really fits you and gives you, brings out the curves shape, yes. the right way. Like embrace them. Yes. Them. Yes. Yes. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. And um, so was this always your your plan like to become a, a plus size stylist or like did you just end up here out of circumstance now and have made the most of it to be honest i'd say it's out of circumstance <laughs> uh i am a trained accountant okay i am a practicing accountant okay and uh it, it uh plus size and everything comes as uh just the way I'd said it earlier, the dressing part. Yeah. So I'd really like an outfit I saw somewhere, but coming to fit it, it really does not work well for me yeah. or does not augur well with where I want to go to. Yeah. So in a way, it started more of as a side hustle. Okay. Then slowly but slowly just picked up. Wow. And there was, I could get an outfit for my size yeah. and also for my fellow sisters too. Yeah. Yes. Well, well done. And mm. in fact, we do have a model who's going to be uh, demoing some different looks for us today. Mm -hmm. She's here with the very first one. So I want her to come on to set and show us uh, what she's wearing. Come on in. Wow, this looks lovely. Thank you. You're going to come and stand right here in the center. <laughs> this is lovely. The color, the, the, it's a jumpsuit. Yes, it is. Wow, tell me about this look. Actually, what we're trying to break the norm that people associate a uh, jumpsuit with the uh, slender ladies. Yes. I want to tell the world and I want Kenya to know that as a plus size lady, you can rock a jumpsuit and, and it she's fits rocking you right. it for sure. Yes. Okay, sis, so we see. <laughs> <laughs> so, this actually can be worn to work on a Friday. It looks This is so mostly good. like a dress down counter outfit yeah. this one you can go with to work that is like i want it <laughs> <laughs> you can have it unfortunately <laughs> we are a plus size house so this you can wear to church you can wear to a function you can wear to a brunch yeah yes oh man and you get it's to so rock it it's so beautiful and i yes. like how you've accessorized it as mm -hmm. well she mm -hmm. just looks so elegant thank you and comfortable she too. is she is yeah mm -hmm. yeah well we're gonna let her go off because she's gonna go change into another look and then she'll be back thank but you. uh maybe you can give us one last look of this gorgeous <laughs> And she's there with her heels. Oh, yes. Yeah, who said you can't wear... Oh, and they're cute ones, too. You need to turn around. <laughs> they're cute, too. Look at that. That's Yay. lovely. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. <laughs> Thank, Thank you, you very much. Mm -hmm. Wow. I, I think that's great. And I love that she's actually in a, a patterned thing. Yes. Because a lot of the times, like, you hear, like, oh, you know, if you're plus size, like, just wear navy blue for the rest of your life. <laughs> Only wear black because yes. black is slimming. Yes. But um, you can experiment, it sounds like, with shapes. Even your outfit yes. you know, has like has patterns prints. and, you this know. This is actually leather here. Wow, look I at that. Even you should be <laughs> modeling your outfits. <laughs> this is it. Like Beautiful. if you could zoom in. This, I believe you can wear anywhere. Yeah. You can go to work in this. You Absolutely. can go to any function in it. Yeah. And then plus it's also like a little bit of stretch in it. Yeah. Yes. Wonderful. So so that's a great outfit as well. Thank you. Tell, tell me about the fabrics and, mm -hmm. and how much does it matter then when you're considering a plus size woman, the type of fabric? Okay. Uh, <clears throat> first, I want to start from saying that 
I am trying to break from the norm that we need to wear boring and dull colors. Mm -hmm. I believe that by the virtue that you're already plus size, you're already track attracting a crowd. That's right. You will, there's no way you will pass a notice. Yeah. So I want you to walk into a room and embrace all the colors too. Yeah. As oh, so if they're going to notice you, let them notice you for something. Give good. them the show, yes. <laughs> give them <laughs> the show. It. So uh, I believe I stock all kinds of fabrics. Okay. I do chiffon. I do the stretches. But I want also, again, to make our plus size ladies believe that an outfit does not need to stretch to fit you. Mm. If you are a size 16, I want you to wear a 16. Yeah. If you are like a 20, don't be ashamed of that. Don't number. be ashamed of that. I don't know why we started shaming each other <laughs> about like which dress size do we wear. Who cares? As long as we look good, Kwani people are, unless people are coming to chungulia your back and to look <laughs> at the label, like it, sh it really shouldn't matter. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because uh, uh, when, when you wear a good dress, automatically your confidence comes Absolutely. up. Absolutely. It, it just, your smile just originates you from inward outward. You could see her, outward. the way she was like, yes. you know, walking with her and, step. And that is why I want, that is why I want plus size women in Kenya to feel good about themselves. Yeah. I know we, we tend to associate ourselves with the big names. We see this kind of a model, oh, she's a size 10, she's a size 12. But I want to give you news. We have plus size people in Kenya. Yeah. We even have our own plus size beauty pageant. Yes, that's which right. Which also builds our confidence and makes us just appreciate life the way it is. Yeah. We feel unique and beautiful. Wonderful. And that is what these pieces that I have is all about that. Oh, I'm so yes. glad to hear that, Trifos. And in fact, Thank we you. do have some images. Our model is already back. <laughs> that was fast. <laughs> but uh, yes. let's give her a moment and mm -hmm. look at some images and then we'll bring her out shortly. Okay. These are some images of um, outfits you styled, I think. Yes. Wow. Tell so me about this look. That's gorgeous. That's a denim jumpsuit. Yeah. It has a little bit ruffles on top. Because mm -hmm. also as plus size chicks, we tend to be shy of the areas that we have add-ons. Mm -hmm. So I believe when you do that, it brings the image up to your shoulders because it has a ruffle. Mm -hmm. The belt just as, uh, tries to cover up the tummy area. Right. It also has perfect pocket, sorry. Mm -hmm. So this kind of an outfit, you can rock it on a uh, dress down there at work. Yeah. And since she has her canvas shoes on Saturday, so you're cute. good to go. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> and that is all about what I believe plus size chicks should be all about. Okay. Yes. Well, let's take a look at another image. Okay. Wow. Wow. Yes, don't be afraid of print. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so that for me was more of an office look. You uh -huh. can I wish you could turn it. <laughs> uh. That's a back image. Okay. So if I could yes, there no, we that's go. it. There this we go. you can wear to any function you that's want. That's true. Yes. Yeah. Prints bring brings the boldness in a lady. You can see from her photo the way she has taken it. Yeah. She's uh, really trying to tell us that her Curves are all intact, they're yes. all, and the outfit just brings it way nice. And that's what we are all about. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Yes. Well, we're going to hold the photos there for now because okay. our next model, I mean, our model is back <laughs> with another look. Yay. And it is, I can see the color from here. It is vibrant. And she looks, she looks good, guys. Mm -hmm. Come on in, my dear. Come on. Okay, sis. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Look at that. It's a beautiful dress. Mm -hmm. She wears it really well, too. Tell mm -hmm. me about this one. These are things now, <laughs> honestly, you'd, <laughs> plus size women, me, you'd, often you'd never hear, at you, oh, you don't wear this. No. You know, the color is going to attract attention mm -mm. and the blocking. <sighs> we believe that as trends go by, we want to be incorporated in the trends, too. Nice. If it's a bold print, I believe it was designed for a small chick to a plus size chick. So... If a trend comes out from where we source our fabrics and outfits from, I believe also a plus size chick should Absolutely. have the same print. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So this is my... So it's not about saying that the clothes is not for you. No, make no, 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 no. Size. You have to make it our size. Yeah. And that is what I believe in. Nice. Yes. We stand wow. out. We rock the same shades. Our fellow sisters do rock. And... We rule this world. <laughs> nice. So if it's not about um, how, what then, are there any tips then for plus size fashion? Because mm -hmm. if you're saying it shouldn't, it's not just about stretch fabric. Mm -hmm. You can wear whatever colors and prints you want. Are mm -hmm. there certain things to keep in mind? I like how this one, this line detail here yeah. at the waistline, yes. it gives that illusion of like the waistline and it's just cinching her waist and really, <laughs> um, <laughs> really accentuating yes. her like, you know, figure. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What I'd like to say is uh, play around with colors. Okay. We have our, our let me sell them like our strength bodies. Yeah. There are people who can be plus size up. 
yeah. and they're small down. Yeah. They can be small up here and they're big down here. Yeah. So I always say like work work with the work with the outfit that works best for you. Okay. Work with the strongholds that is. Okay. And if you have insecurities with any given place, also try to tone it down in that area. Right. right. Like you're saying here on the waist, like here the weights come up. Mm -hmm. This kind of print really just brings it snatches are in yes yes yeah and that gives you that wow effect from behind yeah. and front and, and then it's so funny because typically we'll be told don't put lines you know around your stomach <laughs> and yet this is what's actually like it's really giving that illusion of her waist is like disappearing yes and then like curving out you know at her hips mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so that's more about trendy calves because you want to go with trends yeah and i believe that any plus size she can also rock this trends too okay yes i love it uh. well you can give us one last twirl <laughs> Uh, before you go, okay. <laughs> <laughs> go, girl. I love her confidence. And she as she is. goes to change, I want us to talk about that. Okay. Um, because I feel like, you know, we need to just learn to embrace ourselves. And I really love her confidence. I almost wish we could mic her when she comes for the last one. Sure. Can I ask the crew to help us with that? I feel like her confidence is something to talk about as she goes to change. But okay. um, um, let's talk about that because I feel like, you know, self-esteem is such a big part of, of our self-esteem mm -hmm. reflects in how we carry ourselves, mm -hmm. rather. Mm -hmm. Let me say that. Yes. So when we have really low self-esteem, it shows even in the clothes that we wear. That's when you want to stick, you know, we look like we're going to a funeral all the time. <laughs> <laughs> right? Mm -hmm. But you're saying, no, embrace color, embrace yes. print. Yes. Um, it seems to me that your work really is also about giving back a lot of women that confidence simply through an outfit yes mm -hmm. there is a way an outfit uh, brings out the confidence in a woman there is a way a good thing just lightens brightens your face up uh the few that i've managed to engage with when they walk into my collection point and i see you when you walk in i can easily tell this will work for her this mm -hmm. will not work and mm -hmm. and most of them usually come and say give me a bigger give me a bigger size mm. and i'll tell them no it's not about the size it's about what's in your head yeah because we need to work with what's up here and what's in here mm -hmm. so that at the end of the day it radiates out of your face mm. and also i'd like to say that uh for those of us who grew up being fat for lack of a better word mm -hmm. fat and plus size mm -hmm. i think also society in a way has really make it really screwed it into our heads that so long as you're fat, you're lazy, mm. you're not worth it. Mm -hmm. But I want to tell these women outside here that it's, it's not about your size. Yeah. It, it's not about your size. And if you manage to interact with these plus size mm. ladies, most of them are really good people. Mm -hmm. it, it's not about the food that we do eat. That's, I, I'd call it a comfort zone. Mm -hmm. Rushing to food, it's more of comfort. But everyone does eat. Yeah, yes, yeah. I do eat too. Yeah. And uh, I, I want society to be able to understand us. And even I'd like to give now a shout out to the fashion industry. Okay, go ahead. To be able now to embrace curve, curved women, plus size women for who they are. Because at the end of the day, we use the same products the other ladies use. Mm, mm. So I, I don't believe that this kind of outfit can only be designed from a size maybe 8 to 12 or 10. Mm. This outfit, I have it up to a size 28. Mm -hmm. Yes. And it matters. It makes it's it only makes business sense too yes, for yes. the fashion industry because it's only you know what a handful of people, a fraction of people are going to fall between eight and, and ten or yes. twelve. So <laughs> you know if the if we're going if we're going all the way up until size twenty eight, then mm -hmm. you're missing out on exactly. a whole number of clients because exactly. you've decided that you know it's only for a certain body shape. Yes. But um, we have some more images, so mm -hmm. let's take a look at those very quickly now. I might not be able to bring out our model, it seems, oh. again. I'd really love to chat with her. But tell me about this. I like that she's rocking <laughs> denim head to toe. And it's rugged. And it's rugged. Yes. yes. Edgy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is more of, uh, more of a street strategy. Mm -hmm. Like I told you before, I want it to be embraced in all kinds of categories. Mm -hmm. Like you say office weather, you say casual weather, you say street style. We can rock it too. As you can see, she is having fun it's it's from her face just from up going down yeah and that is what these outfits do to you yeah so long as you wear the right one at the right place for the right occasion yeah it it will work for you okay yes okay let's mm. see what we have next wow wow look at that 
<laughs> That's a color cocktail kind of look. Uh-huh. Yes, because it has a gold, it has a sequins uh-huh. on top. And it is a jumpsuit, actually. Yeah. It is a jumpsuit. So if you want to look a little bit serious, you can throw in a jacket on top. Sure. And you look suited up. Sure. But if you, you can dress down to that more of a cocktail look for me. Yeah. Yes. Well. And th- it sounds like the accessories matter just as well. It so, does. you know, put in a nice pair of shoes, your earrings mm-hmm. or your bangles, whatever mm-hmm. else. Like mm-hmm. it all it all adds up to the look. Yes. Okay. Yes. So it sounds like we're moving away from this idea of if we're already plus size or we're curvy women. So I may not be a plus size woman, but I'm a curvy woman. And I remember growing up, like I was always just trying to hide, <laughs> <laughs> hide my curves. Uh-huh. Right. But, you know, now I'm just like, Man, God gave them to me for yeah. a reason, so mm-hmm. I'm going to, you know, enjoy them mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and um, and wear them proudly. And I I like that that is the message that is coming out of what you're saying. Yes. Um, that you know, being plus size doesn't mean that one isn't worth, you know, anything less than anybody else. Mm-hmm. Uh, if anything, it's an expression of who so many of us are, and that's why we should talk about it all the more. Thank you. And um, do I have my model? She's here. Is she here? And she's rocking the Friday leg. And she's rocking. <laughs> hey, well done, Bona Director Max for the day. And Carol, my producer, Asante Sana. <laughs> she's being mic'd and I'm going to get her here. Oh, she's ready. She hey, well done, Miriam, part of our <laughs> camera crew today. Come now on, my dear. This. Look at you. Aish, you I'll look like you. your money. I like to talk about the outfit. <laughs> <laughs> and now you're mic'd. Tell oh. us your name. My name is Tracy Ndwati. Mm-hmm. And, and you've been here before. Yes, mm-hmm. yes the, you have. Yeah, I'm the current Miss Kenya Plus World. That's right. And a plus size model. Yes. <laughs> yes. Tell us about this look. So this is one of my favorite looks because mm-hmm. it's comfy. Mm-hmm. You can pair it with some heels and make it classy at night. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Or during the day you can wear some sneakers, yeah. be active and yeah. still look good. Yeah. Yeah, it's my favorite actually. You look actually. great. Thank you. Have a seat, please. Thank you. As we have a very quick chat about confidence because you know as we were talking here with with Trufosa just saying how I, I like that the message of all of this is not it's not even at a competition you're not trying to prove a point to anybody mm, mm. else but yourself that yeah. you're still worth it you're beautiful inside out and um, how you look on the outside really is a reflection of how you feel on the inside and you for sure are a very <laughs> confident woman <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> tell me about that and you know especially in light of what we've been talking about fashion you know yeah. were there ever moments in your life where you'd feel like oh I have to hide myself or oh, yes. yeah I mean because people always point out your flaws mm. at all times so exactly. Um, there's your tummy, there's the boobs, mm-hmm. there's the bum. So you always, I used to wear a lot of baggy stuff yeah. and cover up. Yeah. But once I started to feel myself and say, you know what, it's my body. Yeah. And it's me who decides how I'll look, but classy at the same time. Mm-hmm. I started to experiment and I met my beautiful <laughs> stylist oh, here. <laughs> wonderful. Well, yeah. if someone here says fashion is life and character. Those clothes are good. Um, oh, hello, yeah. full circle. Hey, that first model killed it. In <laughs> fact, it's the same model, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> They're saying, in fact, I almost passed out. <laughs> She's a horsepower. She st- I started liking plus size. Hey, okay, okay. Inter or something. This one you're going to have to read it by yourself. But uh, ladies, my time is up. I do need to get ready for my second hour of the show. Trifosa, thank you so much for coming. Tracy, thank you for coming and just shining your light and your confidence here. How can people get in touch with you? Should they want some styling services? Do you have a boutique they can go to? How do they reach you? Okay. I do have a boutique. It's at Fatima Court, mm-hmm. Chaka Place, Makaskavi. Yeah. Uh, on Instagram, on, I'm on Instagram. I'm known as the official Trendy Crafts KE. Yeah. Uh, I can also give you my numbers sure. later. You can share it with them. No, go ahead. Oh, go ahead. my number is 0720 Mm-hmm. And we deliver throughout the country. All right. Yes. Accountant by day, <laughs> stylist by day too. I love it. Thank you okay. both so much for being here on the Thank show. This you. has been great talking mm-hmm. with you. And hopefully you guys have learned a thing or two there. Embrace your curves. Embrace how God made you. You are beautiful. And that beauty and confidence begins from the inside, from here. Yes. Like you said. Yeah from right here Mm. all right guys let's take a break now as we get ready for our second hour of the show coming up next we're going to be talking about body workouts that you can do at home so anzeni kusongeza coffee table na maviti our workout segment is coming up next i'll see you at 9 a.m